I've been training in the US for pretty much my entire professional career and I just decided that you know for this year I wanted to try something different um, just traveling to Europe to compete and to do the different European circuits the travel has been you know really really tough on my body being here I don't have to adjust to the time difference every time so I thought it would be you know a wise decision to try to move to Europe to train. The reason I chose to train with Dennis is because on one of my European circuits in the Czech Republic, he actually, you know, assisted me in my competition. And in that competition, you know, I jumped at indoor PR. So I was like, oh, wow. So that's the first person who came to mind when I decided that I should move to Europe to compete. And then I contacted him and, you know, he was willing and excited to work with me. So fortunately, he was already at Bath tra um, training with Tom. And being Tom's training partner at the time, I thought it was a plus, you know, being UK's number one high jumper, you know, why not train with somebody, you know, at such high caliber. So I was like, okay, moving over here and then being at Bath would be like a great experience and I've been here ever since. Yeah, it's pretty much almost the same like the US. So the track is right there, the gym is there, the sand pit is there and um, I love the ice bath, it helps me recover very well. I think it's a great facility and thumbs up to Bath University, so yeah. In terms of training, I think it has been one of my toughest, toughest seasons. Everything being locked down in the UK has been really strict. Um, you know, no gyms, no track, not being able to do any technical work. And just being outside in this weather wasn't the best for me. I, I really don't like the cold, but I think I've gotten a lot better being here in the UK. So I think that's a plus. I'm thankful for Bath, you know, making it available for me to be back in here. I don't think there's one thing I need to train that I can't really find here. So I think, you know, moving forward, training would be a lot easier and back to normality and I think we should be ready and be at where I need to be when Tokyo comes around. I'm looking forward to jumping well at the first Diamond League. Um, it's going to be here in the UK so hopefully being here would be, would be a plus. I haven't done a lot of jumping so I think the more I jump uh, the better I get. I just think that's the kind of athlete I am. Um, so, yeah, I am looking forward to doing a few competitions and hopefully, you know, it will sharpen me up for Tokyo.